Okay, ciao guys, I hope you can hear me. We are on a hippity hoppin' adventure in Kuala Lumpur. We're uncovering today a little hidden gem for afternoon tea, or I like calling it high tea. So come along with me, I'm gonna show you what the Element Kuala Lumpur high tea looks like. And before anything, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. I am Wander with Angela. I'm home based in Kuala Lumpur and share the best of Asia a couple times a week. I also share what it's like living here in Southeast Asia. So what you're gonna notice first off with the Element High Tea is that it is vibrant. It has this kind of uh, like real colorful edge to it that isn't about the crockery like you get in most places. You'll see a sea of green, which is this grassy area in the middle of the savory section, and it's just lovely. They even have a waffle cone savory salmon, which is, well, I haven't tried yet, we'll try that just in a second. But they offer a few teas. It's a little bit limited on the selection of teas. There are scones with chocolate and with clotted cream. There are beef croquettes, there are savory macaroons, and finger sandwiches. So it's a little bit of everything. It tears more to the savory side, which is wild, because most tear more to the... But you know what, though? I think I'm just at the beginning of this, and there's still something to come because there's an artistry element that I read about. So I don't, let me carry on with all of this and we will come back as soon as I know if, uh, as soon as the next part begins. Was totally worth the wait. So what they do for the dessert portion uh, is insane and super sweet. You definitely have to have a sweet tooth or about three kids with you because it's crazy, crazy, yummy, sweet goodness. They actually lay out kind of a wax paper on the table and there's a really sweet uh, chef who comes over and actually does freestyle artistry with uh, syrups. I'm sure some kind of, well, it's like chocolate syrup, different strawberry and uh, other sweet types of syrup. And then she puts it all out and kind of uh, lays out like cookie bits and, and other ingredients on there, like marshmallows and other amazing things. And it's really cute. In the end, she drew my name as well. I ordered a glass of wine for the dessert portion. Inside that chocolate ball are brownies and marshmallows that now have hot chocolate syrup over them. I feel like I won't eat for two days if I touch any of this, but I'm sure I'll go in for the macaroon. But it's really cute. It's a very different kind of afternoon tea. It's quite festive and fun. And if you have kids, I think this would be a huge hit. So yeah, it was really, really fun. I'll put a link down below to the uh, Facebook and Instagram for Element so you can see because they probably change out the type of high tea um, that they're offering periodically. But right now, this is, it is very cute. All right, thanks guys, Element, for making this really special for me and for writing my name. That was very cute. Bye, guys.